BioBlitz is an effort to document all the life in a, in a particular area uh, with particular emphasis on, on layers of life that we're not accustomed to seeing all the time. You get a lot of people on the ground, catch as many things as you can and identify them in a short period of time. In, in conservation biology, uh, you can't protect something if you don't know it's there. Uh, you have to know what it is you're, you're trying to protect. So one of the ways we find out how something is there is to do an inventory and determine if that species is present in a given geographic area and BioBlitz has served that very purpose. Love. Dr. Carver would have loved uh, what we're doing right now. Just really digging into nature and finding the different kinds of species of insects and animals. And, and it's so cool to walk where he walked here at this great uh, national monument and uh, catalog the different animals that... This information will be entered into a national database and it will, one, the park will have that information available to it where it can say, yes, these species are present. They can use that in their management plans should it ever become necessary. Or other scientists may be interested in studying the distribution of animals over a, a much broader area and that data will be available to them to add to their study and fill in data holes and uh, missing, missing gaps. A lot of people think, well, what can I do? I, I don't know anything, I can't do anything. And this is an opportunity for people to go out, collect data, work with other people, and actually add to the body of knowledge in terms of what's out there. And so they get the appreciation and they're also contributing to, to the knowledge base of what's around because we don't really know enough about a lot of species, where they live, where they don't live, and what the distributions are. It's good to develop uh, citizen scientists and uh, new stewards for the park who will take care of it after we're gone. And that's the, that's the beauty of all of this. They're volunteering for the parks and doing something that is, is very beneficial and meaningful in the long run.